I'm in a little better shape than I was the last time I left here. Yeah. Oh, I smell the plywood. I love that smell. I'm glad you do. It smells like work to me. Up in Kentucky, a shine-making couple are getting back to work after their season came to a crashing halt. Chico's motorcycle accident has put the Shiners weeks behind schedule. I will not be caught dead without a helmet ever again. A small price to pay after his near-death experience. You can't just judge a book by its cover. He has a big heart. People don't know him the way that I do. You know, I was beat up pretty bad, busted my eye, knocked my teeth out, but I can't stand to sit at the house no longer. Grab your little screws and your little block. What are you doing? I'm the holder. You hold me up. <laughs> we're in the heart of this season, and thus far, we ain't made a drop of liquor. Before Chico and Sandra make their first run, they need to finish the still sight. You didn't put that one flush with the end, don't forget. I don't want it flush with the that end. That one is flush with I the end. I know it is. I'm just giving you an opinion. Opinion is just like butthole. <laughs> Everybody's got one. Most of them stink. Sandra's as strong a woman as you're gonna find. If it wasn't for her, I probably wouldn't heal as quick as I have. She's the glue that keeps all this running. If we can get this finished, man, we'd be pumping whiskey out of here nonstop. Me and Sandra were disguised our steel side as a deer camp, so we're building up a deer feeder, which is actually gonna be the cover to my steel. To avoid detection, Chico and Sandra are disguising their operation as a deer hunting site. They've already built the deer stand that will hide their mash barrels and are now constructing a decoy deer feeder to camouflage their still. Once built, the feeder will cover their still, which sits below the deer stand. When the duo is ready to run liquor, a pulley system will raise the feeder, allowing access to the still. Once distillation is complete, they simply lower the feeder to hide their entire operation in plain sight. Now, if we get this mounted, we're going to put another piece of four before across the top. That way, we got there, something there. to hook it to when we want to pick it up and down. It's starting to look like a box. You don't think this whole setup is going to be too heavy? You believe it'll fit underneath our deer stand? I don't believe, woman. I know. It became pretty apparent to me as soon as we started building it that we were not talking about the same thing. This isn't even a box. You built you built a trapezoid. A trapezoid. Yep. The bottom of it's going to be rectangle, and the top of it's going to be rectangle, but the ends is going to be in a V shape. So we're not building a box. No, we're All not. Right. We're building the. It's a disguise, not a function. I'm getting a little anxious. This box is pretty big. It's a cumbersome shape. We have to be able to lift it up. And he's telling me it'll work. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. But yeah, I'm a little skeptical, you know? We've got just boards kind of hanging here and hanging here. And I'm trusting him a little bit. 